In this video, we're going to take a look at the steps we need to take in order to create our lighting fixtures, both the ceiling mounted as well as our wall mounted. So let's go ahead and get started so that we can create our view similar to what you're seeing on your screen right now. So we're going to focus our attention on the lighting fixtures just for the gallery space in this one. So I'm going to go ahead and go back to my ceiling plan for this space and zoom in on that. Now let's come on up to our architectural tab, still our component tool, and we're just going to click on place component. If you already have some ceiling fixtures loaded, you could go ahead and just start there. However, we need to load the families. So I'm just going to browse out. We're going to come out here to our lighting architectural we're going to use the interior lighting and we're going to load two types of lights for this example we're going to use our sconce lights up lighting that's going to be wall hosted and I'm going to hold down control and I'm going to also select our trough for light the 2 by 4 parabolic and I'm going to click open just to insert both of these families into our project so that we can use them here. All right, now that they've loaded, we're going to go ahead and scroll down on the list. Let's find our trough for light, the 2 by 4. We're going to go with the 4 lamp 277 volt. Knowing that we'll be rendering these views later, and I'm just going to go ahead and drop. Then we're going to rotate it. Next, I'm just going to click on this fixture. And now we're going to align it to get it properly in the grid. So I'm going to select the grid. Then I'm going to select the edge of my light fixture. Then I'm going to select the other grid line and select the edge of the fixture again. Now we know that our grid is properly has our lighting fixture attached. I'm going to select my grid and I'm just going to move it up a little bit more so that we can place another row of fixtures in here as well. There we are. Actually, I'm going to move it a little bit just to get it centered in here. There we go. So now I'm just going to select this fixture and go ahead and copy it. And I know that we're working with a 2x4 grid so I'm just going to come down eight feet and copy it in here. Then I'm going to select both of these and I'm just going to copy them over as well. Now I've got my two by four trough for lights copied in place. In order to place my wall mounted lighting fixtures, I'm actually going to switch to a plan view. Now in this plan view I can see the openings in my wall and make sure that we're coordinating these wall mounted fixtures. So let's go ahead and come back to component and we'll click on place component, come over to properties and change this back to our wall sconce. We're going to use the 100 watt 277 volts. And I'm just going to place one in the wall here and here. Then I'm just going to give myself a couple in these side walls. Just to give a nice showcase feel to the gallery that we're creating here.
let's just go ahead and create a camera view from our quick access toolbar we're just going to create our camera view looking out the window So there you have it. There's our room. You'll see that both are ceiling. I'm actually going to click on my ceiling and we have an eight foot ceiling height. Let's go ahead and move that up. Give ourselves a 12 foot ceiling. And I'm going to click on that jipboard ceiling that we placed as well. We're actually going to put that at 11 foot six inches. And that's going to give the give us the volume of space that we were looking for here in our gallery. I hope this video has been helpful.